I hate both of you, motherfuckers! I tell you! How you guys doing? You want more? Then shut up! everyone, I'd like to take this opportunity to address a number of issues that have circulated in the media over the last few days. There has been a serious accusation from the Toronto Star that I use crack cocaine. I do not use crack cocaine, nor am I an addict of crack cocaine. As for a video, I cannot comment on a video that I have never seen or does not exist. It is most unfortunate, very unfortunate, that my colleagues and the great people of this city have been exposed to the fact that I have been judged by the media without any evidence. Any 15 minutes, it's all no interference, brother. If I win, I will donate. This past week has not been an easy one. It has taken a great toll on my family, and my friends, <clears throat> and the great people of Toronto. Brother, 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 I think I some clone. I give you some clone. I have it. I'm taller, brother. You know me. Mr. Mayor, have you purchased illegal drugs in the last two years? Yes, I have. Are you then saying then that you have violated the council code of conduct? In what respect? I'm asking you a question, sir. I, well, in what respect? I'm asking you a question. From denying reports, he visited a crack house. Hear my answer. Actually, you're not being truthful. That's I'm not being truthful. Have you been into that house? I have no interest in being in that house. I'm not a crack user. So, you know. Have I done drugs? Yes, I have. But it's self-inflicted. Will you get help? I'm not an addict of any sort. That's so not. I'm not quite sure why you're saying I need help. I'm absolutely not taking a leave of absence. Let, let, I'm moving on. You guys can do what you want. I apologize again. I'm sorry. That's all I have to say. So you, you, you asked me a couple of questions. And what were those questions? Do you smoke crack cocaine? Exactly. Am I an addict? No. Yes, I've made, mis I've made mistakes. I, all I can do now is apologize and move on. I don't know what I'll... Oh, guys, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, can I, can I just... Yeah, go ahead. Yes, please. All I can say is... But, um... That's exactly it. That's, that's a guy. I don't know what else I can say to you. Is that the I'm talking to you. It's my guy's But I'll fight it. I'll try one else. I'll fight it. No holds part, brother. He dies or I die, brother. I'm talking to you. Brother, you've never seen me go through that. Yeah, so, brother, when he's down there, I'll rip his throat out, I'll pull his eyes out. When he's dead, he'll make sure that mother is dead. I need 10 minutes to make sure he's dead. It'll be over five minutes, brother. So, I've done it 10 minutes, minutes out. After you went brother, it'll be a bad scene. I didn't want to sick mother dude, but no one's gonna around me. My, my brothers are, don't tell me we're liars. These birds, birds, the little birds like this, this daddy. Oh, my man, he walks his own person. Like, 80 little birds, probably. Oh, this shit, brother. I, I just need to go by myself. I, I want to go with Jack. I need 15 minutes. That's all. No interference, brother. If I win, I will 
donate. These guys are pros, buddy. Yeah? No problem, bro. No problem. I need 15 minutes. I need 15 minutes. Too much time. No, no, no. I need five minutes. minutes. No, no, no. I'm going to do it for five. No, 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 no. I'm going to do it for five. I'm going to prepare it for it. I'll call it. No, it did not rain. And the last thing was um, Olivia Gondak. It, it says that I wanted to eat her pussy. Olivia Gondak. I've never said that in my life to her. I would never do that. I'm happily married. I've got more than enough to eat at home. Thank you very much. Counselors could only scold. I have never heard such disgraceful language and statements made in the public realm by an elected official ever. If you're offended, I'm not apologizing because put yourself in my shoes if someone said that about your husband or your wife, Councillor Davis, okay? Enough is enough. Yes, it is for many. Notice that jersey he's wearing from his beloved Toronto Argonauts? Well, the team wasn't impressed to see him in that shirt making his charming comments this morning and issued a statement saying the situation with respect to the mayor and his leadership is unseemly at best. The mayor is now not invited to the playoff game this weekend. And he has upset the Ford Motor Company, which wants its logo off his shirts. Even Toronto schools have cancelled all field trips to City Hall. It's apparently not safe. Message received? Perhaps not. The mayor has now said he will sue ex-staffers and bar employees who spoke to police. It's not clear what for, but the threat is there. Please, this is really serious. Of course it is. Serious, too, is the matter of what on earth happens next for governance of Toronto. Ontario's premier suggested the province may at some point need to step in, and councillors still seem to be searching for a way to oust the mayor. He surely won't go quietly, is still stubborn about staying put. He held yet another microphone moment this afternoon, pleading for privacy, yet standing with his rarely seen wife at his side. Revelations. Yesterday, of cocaine, escorts, and prostitution has pushed me over the line. And I used unforgivable language. Hello? There are three ways Rob Ford could lose his job. If the mayor is convicted of a criminal offense and serves time in jail. If he is absent from City Hall three months in a row without authorization or if City Council goes 60 consecutive days without reaching its quorum of 23. But if that happened, the whole council would be dissolved and by-elections held for every seat. I'm getting to my question, thank you. Okay, Councillor Ainsley, you got your own issues. Councillor so Ford... I wouldn't be saying too much. Councillor Ford, please direct the question through the chair to the staff. Again, who, who, do, who, do, I, who, do, I, who do I speak to about the proper code of conduct. Councillor, matters with respect to code of conduct. Stop. Mayor Ford, please stop disrupting. Do you know when we ended up getting this motion? 26 minutes before the meeting. This is not democracy. Is that fair that we get a motion 26 minutes before, before we decide on trying to now, illegally pull... Mr. Ford, please ask a I'm question. I'm asking the question. Ten-minute recess. No. Ten-minute recess. No. 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 This, folks, reminds me of when, and I was watching with my brother, when Saddam attacked Kuwait. And President Bush said, I warn you, I warn you, I warn you, do not. Well, folks, if you think American-style politics is nasty, you guys have just attacked Kuwait. And you will never... Okay, you will never see something that you have marked my words, friends. This is going to be outright war in the next election. And I'm going to do everything in my power. Okay, Mayor Ford, your time's up. Everything in my power to beat you guys.
Thank and you, that, Mayor Ford. What you're doing to me is kicking me out of my office, and it's the worst thing that you can do. I was elected by the people. Mayor Ford. Mad? You're absolutely right on that. Because every one of you guys have said. Mayor Ford, your time's up. And it is absolutely the worst thing you can do for democracy. Thank you. In the city of Toronto. Thank you. What goes around, comes around, friends. Remember what I'm saying. Maybe right about now you're feeling a little sorry from Rob Ford. People do make mistakes. Heck, I'm a liberal. I think we'd all be better off being less judgmental and more compassionate about people's struggles with intoxicants. But Rob Ford has done worse things than do drugs. All you have to do is Google the guy to find out. He's used racial slurs. He once claimed there should be no funding for AIDS prevention since only gays can catch it. He's anti-union, anti-tax, and as mayor, he's privatized half the garbage pickup, took away the right of transit workers to strike, cut bus routes, forced key concessions from public sector workers, refused to provide needed shelter for the homeless.